I can't let you go. I won't let you leave. Hey, what's good, everybody? What's up, ladies? This your girl, Jazzy and Baby. If you're on Dominic, you know me as Mr. Rude Bastard or the previous, the new name I got, Teddy J. I'm back at it again for another quick video. And this goes out to my, one of my favorite pages on Facebook now, Fans with Attitude. And, um, yeah, they be having some real stuff on their page. And this is where I got this topic from. Uh, the vice president, Mimi, which is also my my ex, but one of my bestest film friends ever. And she won. She was like, I asked, I text all the fans of my phone, like, what is my new video going to be about? And she was like, why do studs? have a problem with their girlfriends being cool with other studs. So, I'm going to talk from my point of view. Some things, in some situations, I feel like it's cool for my girlfriend to be friends with their stud. As long as I know who their stud is, and, you know, she ain't trying to cross that line. But if she's trying to cross that line, I'm going to have a problem with it. Because that is disrespectful. But, I mean, that's all I can say from my point of view. But, it, yeah, it depends on how tight of y'all. Like, Mimi had, has a best friend, Prince J. She's stud. Never did I ever have a problem with that. They've been friends for years. Who am I to come through a, a, a friendship? And I'm not about all telling my girlfriend's, hey, you can't talk to this person. Or, you can't talk to me. Blah, 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 blah. A lot of times, some studs be hating on the other stud because they, they feel threatened. And I'm here to tell you, if you or any of my ex's girlfriends feel threatened, I'm just saying, it's not that I'm going to disrespect you, but I'm that nigga. Pound, pound. Like, we will always have a connection. I'm always going to be there for them. The moment you, you, you try to drop them, I'm going to be right there. Because, you know, friendships come and go, but love lasts forever. If you ever love somebody, you're going to always be there for that person. You may not love them intimately like a, a relationship, you know, a girlfriend, girlfriend type, but... If you love somebody, you're going to be there for them regardless of who they with. It don't make me know never mind because guess what? Yes, I'm that nigga. I'm that nigga that she's going to call when you cheat on her. And I'm that nigga that's going to whoop your ass. It's just how it is. And when I say whoop your ass, it ain't even got to be hands. Because I don't throw hands because you're not worth it. But I will have some choice words for you. And a lot of times, you know, I won't say nothing because out of their respect for them, they say no, don't say nothing. That's fine. But all my exes, I cut for y'all. Y'all already know that. And there's really no reason for your girlfriends to be jealous of me or to not want me to be your friend because a lot of times I also talk in y'all favor. I'm like, man, oh, you know you like her. Uh, you know. I be giving advice. And you know that, Mimi. But yeah. A lot of it is just ignorance and just petty. But then, you know, also, they might have a problem because they know how they are. So they wouldn't want their girlfriend friends with somebody like them while they're in a relationship with them. I don't know. Insecurity. Basically, they're just insecure. In a nutshell, everybody has a little bit of it. Of course, I'm gonna question if you randomly be like, "Yeah, baby, this my my stud brother, killer, or big bone daddy bags." Yeah, I'm. Who the fuck is big bone daddy motherfucking bags, baby? Like, I don't know this bitch. Oh, honey, we've been knowing each other for three years, but babe, you did not. You, you didn't tell me who this. It's not telling me. You know, you never brought her up. Yeah, so 
one, one thing you can do to soften the room. Can you just talk about a little, talk about them a little bit? <laughs> Cause then maybe they're not gonna be, you know, studs get suspicious all the time. Not me, cause I really don't give a rat's ass. But yeah. I hope I answered y'all question, friends with attitude. If y'all don't know, y'all need to go and add. I'm gonna try to put a link right here in the description bar. Y'all add friends with attitude on Facebook. That's F E M. I think it's F E M Z W I T attitude. A T T I T U D E. Y'all go ahead and add them or whatever. And I'm gonna go ahead and cut this video short. I hope I answered y'all question. Much love. I'm gonna play a little music while I'm going to sign off.